Hello everyone, my name is Blake Walker. It is officially Saturday, October 26th. It is 12.02 a.m. And we have finished week nine of the Iowa high school football season. And my goodness, folks, it was an unbelievable, unbelievable week. Um, probably the best week of the season. And of course, it came this late in the year. Plenty of playoff matchups, class 2A, 1A, A, and 8 player all played their playoff games tonight. Plenty of upsets. Plenty of upsets everywhere. In 5A, it was a huge night, and we have our playoff teams. Our games do not come out till tomorrow, so you can check those out on the IHSAA website. 5A, 4 all the playoff games for next week go out tomorrow at 10 o'clock, a.k.a. October 26th at 10 a.m., so about 12 hours from now. Not 12 hours, I can't count. 10 hours from now from when I am recording this podcast episode. So let's go over the scores tonight in Iowa high school football. We'll start out with Class 5A, and then I'll give you who made it in Class 5A for the postseason. Ankeny defeats Cedar Rapids, Washington. Number 12, Ankeny defeats Cedar Rapids, Washington, 56 to nothing. Number 9, Iowa City High upsets number 1, Ventendorf, 42 to 23. Number 4th ranked Johnston takes down number 8th ranked Sioux City East 35 to 14 and Des Moines East defeats Des Moines Roosevelt 25 to 20. Number 3 Dowling Catholic defeats Sioux City North 46 to 6 and number 10th ranked Ankeny Centennial defeats Urbandale 49 to 7. Walkie Northwest gets past Ames 50 to 6 and Prairie upsets number 11 Iowa City West 28-21. Number 7th ranked Valley defeats Marshalltown 35 to 8 and number 16th ranked Waukee defeats Council Bluffs Lincoln 66 to 7. Cedar Falls defeats Davenport West 56 to nothing. Dubuque Hempstead over Davenport Central 40 to 7. Number 2 ranked Iowa City Liberty defeats Jefferson of Cedar Rapids 70 to 33. Muscatine defeats Dubuque Senior 26 to 20 27 26 and number 6th ranked Pleasant Valley defeats number 5th ranked Linmar 35 to 21. Davenport North drops their game to Cedar Rapids Kennedy, 34-17. And Waterloo West scores on a touchdown in the final minute to get past 13th-ranked Ottumwa. Number 14th-ranked Waterloo West wins 28-21. Your playoff teams in Class 5A are as follows. These are not in the order, no particular order of their ranking. Your playoff teams for 5A follows. Bentendorf, Ankeny, Sioux City East, Waterloo West, Pleasant Valley, Linmar, Johnston, Iowa City West, Iowa City High, Waukee, Dowling, Iowa City Liberty, Cedar Falls, Dowling Catholic, or excuse me, Ankeny Centennial, Southeast Polk, and Valley. Those are your teams for Class 5A of who made the postseason. We'll go on to Class 4A. Lamars defeats Storm Lake 49 to nothing. Number 6 ranked Gilbert defeats number 3rd ranked Pella 14 to 7. Number 5th ranked Lewis Central defeats Dallas Center Grimes 49 to 8 and Denison Schleswig defeats Sioux City West 51 to 15. Winner set over Council Bluffs Jefferson 56 to 7. Number 14th ranked Ballard over Boone 42 to nothing. Number 15th ranked Newton over Des Moines Hoover 49 to 7. Indianola over Des Moines North 69 to 18. Number 1 North Polk defeats number 4 ADM 27 to 14. Number 16 Norwalk defeats Glenwood 29 to 26. Number 13th ranked Fort Dodge gets past number 7th ranked Spencer 24 to 20. Carlisle defeats Bondurant 21 to 14. 12th ranked Clear Creek Amanda gets past Clinton 56 to 22. Number 11 Waverly Shell Rock defeats Marion 28 to 6. Number 2 Decora defeats Waterloo East 35 to 10. Number 10, North Scott, defeats Oskaloosa, 56-7. Number 8, Western Dubuque, defeats Mason City, 56-21. And number 9, Xavier, defeats Burlington, 49-6. Your Class 4A playoff teams are as follows, again, in no particular order. North Polk, Pella, Gilbert, Decora, ADM, North Scott, Xavier, Newton, Spencer, Fort Dodge, Ballard, Lewis Central, Norwalk, Clear Creek Amana, Waverly Shell Rock, and Western Dubuque. Those are your 16 playoff teams in Class 4A. Let's move down to Class 3A, where number 8 Bishop Heelan gets upset by number 12 MOC Floyd Valley, 49-21. Number 15th ranked Clear Lake defeats Charles City, 55-0. Creston defeats Perry, 72-13. Number 4th ranked Algona defeats Hampton Dumont Cal, 31-6. 
Number one, Humble over Webster City, 28-14. Number 13th ranked Harlan over Knoxville, 42-7. Number 14th ranked Carroll over Boyden Hole Rock Valley, 42-13. Number two, Sergeant Bluff Luton over Sioux Center, 28-21. Number 10th ranked Solon over South Tama, 54-6. Number 7th ranked Mount Vernon over Keokuk, 62-7. Number 11th ranked Benton upsets number five, Williamsburg, 21-0. A shocker over there in Van Horn. Number 16th ranked Grinnell defeats Fairfield 45 to 27. Washington over Fort Madison 41-21. Number third ranked Wallert Catholic defeats Pocotta 49 to 7. Number ninth ranked Independence over Center Point Urbana 57 to 30. Mount Pleasant drops their game to Assumption 35 to nothing. Number sixth ranked Nevada defeats Atlantic 42 to 7, and West Delaware defeats Central DeWitt 35 to nothing. Your Class 3A playoff teams are as follows in no particular order. Sergeant Bluff Luton, Bishop Heelan, Carroll, MOC Floyd Valley, Humboldt, Algona, Clear Lake, Waller Catholic, Independence, Mount Vernon, Assumption, Williamsburg, Nevada, Benton, Solon, and Harlan. Grinnell misses the postseason for those local listening. Grinnell misses the postseason by one spot for the second straight year. A tough break for Grinnell. They needed MOC Floyd Valley to lose to Bishop Heelan. And MOC Floyd Valley upset Bishop Heelan. Tough luck for the Grinnell Tigers. Those are your playoff fields and games for 5A, 4A, and 3A. Let's move on to 2A and talk about your postseason. I'll only be talking about the playoff games. There were a couple Week 9 games, but I'll just be running through the playoff games. In Class 2A, first round action. Anamosa defeats Wakan 46-40 in a thriller. They come back down from 20 to win that game. Kemper Catholic defeats Sheridan 48-7. Central Lion George Little Rock defeats Forest City 60-32. And Green County defeats Clarinda 30-6. Mid Prairie defeats Union 35-7. North Fayette Valley over Monticello 42-14. Mediapolis upsets Northeast 21-6. Western Christian over Okaboji 41-28. Osage over Jessup 53-13. PCM over Des Moines Christian 41-19. Crestwood goes on the road and upsets Roland Story, 27-23. Spirit Lake survives Cherokee, Washington in a final-minute touchdown, 31-27. Van Meter over Albia, 56-10. West Burlington over Centerville, 38-22. West Lyon over Garner Hayfield Ventura, 42-0. And West Marshall defeats West Liberty, 34-6. Those are your Class 2A playoff scores. Your Class 1A first round looked like this. AHSTW drops their game to Hinton, 48-20. Sumner Fredericksburg upsets Beckman Catholic, 12-0. Dyke New Hartford defeats Ogden, 54-0. Emmitsburg over Grandview Christian, 57-7. Grundy Center over Eddyville Blakesburg Fremont, 55-16. Woodward Granger over Eastsack County, 28-6. Manson N.W. Webster over Hudson, 18-7. MFL Marmack defeats Alburnett, 24-21. South Hamilton over Sioux Central, 22-21. OABCIG over Shenandoah, 55-14. Pleasantville drops their game to Regina Catholic, 32-21. Underwood upsets Ridgeview, 21-10. West Branch upsets Sigourney Kyoto, 41-33. South Harden defeats Pella Christian, 40-7. Trainer defeats West Sioux, 28-14. And Wilton defeats Applington Parkersburg, 38 to 14. Those are your Class 1A playoff scores. In Class A, ACGC defeats Wayne 28 to nothing. Galen Catholic defeats St. Albert 48 24, and Bellevue defeats Danville 43 to 7. Lisbon over Starmont 49 to nothing. Madrid over North Tama 41 to 6. Makoka Valley over Columbus 61 to 13. MMCRU over Logan Magnolia 47 to 14. Mount Air over Earlham in a shootout, 58-50. Nashua Plainfield defeats Newman Catholic, 30-14. Pekin survives North Lynn, 28-20. Riverside holds off Linville Sully, 29-27. St. Ansgar over South Winnesheek, 54-14. Tri-Center over South Central Calhoun, 41-0. Wapsie Valley defeats Lake Mills, 50-6. West Hancock defeats Hartley Melvin Sandboard, 65-27. And Woodbury Central defeats Sibilio Cheaton 28-21. Those are your Class A playoff scores. And finally, on to Class 8 player, where Audubon defeats East Mills 38-7. Bedford survives Belle Plaine 18-12, a rare low-scoring 
an eight-player score. Bishop Garrigan defeats Tripola 62 to 15. Waco over Central City 39 to 16. Edgewood Colesburg defeats BGM 92 to 56. Don Bosco over Springville 66 to 19. Arweva over Fremont Mills 51 to 22. Gladbrook Rhinebeck over Key 62 to 30. Iowa Valley outlasts, outlasts Southeast Warren 64 to 48. Janesville over St. Edmund 56 to 14. Lennox over Exira EHK 72 to 16. Montezuma outlasts Winfield Mount Union 61 to 54. Remsen St. Mary's defeats West Bend Mallard 42 to 8. Riceville over Clarksville 64 26. Cam gets past GTRA 67 to 64. And Woodbine defeats Collins Maxwell 50 to 14. That is all your scores and all your playoff teams so far. Again, every matchup next week for next week's games will be posted tomorrow at 10 o'clock a.m. Central Time on the IHSAA website. So make sure to tune in for that. I'm Blake Walker. Thank you so much for listening. I'll be back for next week for the postseason fully. And hope you enjoy your weekend, everyone. Thanks for listening.